When the Titans selected J.C. Latham in the first round of the 2024 NFL Draft, the team believed they had found their left tackle of the future. The 21-year-old Latham isn't just a massive person who has unusual athletic gifts. He is mature beyond his years and has a true drive to be great. As Amy Wells has observed over the last five months, J.C. Latham seems to be a perfect fit for the Tennessee Titans in every way. When J.C. Latham first set foot in the Titans facility, we should have known that something special was about to happen. You see, Latham's official pre-draft visit to Ascension St. Thomas Sports Park happened on the day of the solar eclipse. The planets, or at least the moon and the sun, quite literally aligned. I'm talking to um, Coach Callahan and, you know, we had a 30 minute window to talk and next thing you know, it's been two hours. So luckily our, our meeting was right before lunch. So um, you're there like, yeah, you kind of got to skip lunch and head over here because you, uh, you guys are talking all day. A meeting like that makes up for the fact that Latham didn't even get to see the eclipse, but he did get a peek into his future. One with position coach, Bill Callahan. And then you want to pick your whole arm. Yeah. When I strike it, it's that strike. Kind of. Yes, sir. Okay. Don't, that's why you're sliding, Jason. Okay? Okay. Here we go. Callahan brings 46 years of coaching experience to the Titans offensive line. So for Latham, a kid who moved from Wisconsin to Florida to attend IMG Academy and then played at Alabama, all in pursuit of facing the top competition, Bill Callahan is the perfect teacher. <laughs> you know, you don't really get a lot of credit or, you know, kids call it like cool points, you know, for beating up the guys you're supposed to beat up. But when you go against the top dogs and all that stuff, that's when you really earn your um, right and respect. So, um, you know, Saban had a quote um, that he said a lot, uh, when a student is ready to learn, the teacher will appear. And I, I've been um, unintentionally following that my whole life, you know, whenever I feel like I was ready for the next phase, you know, the next journey would begin, whether it was IMG, Alabama, all that. So, um, yeah, I've always wanted to, go against the best to be the best version of myself. He's very, very um, intricate with the detail of the work, and he'll let you know if you, if you had a bad rep, he'll just tell you your rep sucked. And then, um, <laughs> but if you, if, you did, if you did good, he'll let you know you did good. He'll show you areas to improve in, and um, you know, he's really, he's really intricate, even in the meetings, you know, he'll show us um, the film and um, what it should look like, how it's supposed to be done. He'll talk to us about it. And then he'll even just grab random guys and be like, hey, all right, let me see you do this, do this, do that. All of that attention to detail is paying off. Coach Callahan already sees improvement in his new left tackle. He's built a little bit differently from a mental aspect from most first rounders that I've been around. He'll he'll always do the extra. He's always out here every day. He's uh, really obsessive about giving get everything correct. He's a perfectionist that way, so it's fun to watch him go back out on the field and correct something that he wants to get better at. He doesn't carry himself like a rookie, which is always a good thing. He spends a lot of time on this. I think he understands, which not all rookies understand, that it is a job. Um, and there's an expectation, especially when you're drafted where, you're, where he was drafted, that um, you got to come perform. And I think that he's, he's aware of that. Not everybody always is. And uh, he's got some maturity to him. But he also has a... Um, a youthful, a youthful wonder that's kind of fun to be around. He's everything's new to him. You know, there's just a lot, and he's and he just loves playing football. Great teachers create a solid foundation, but feeling truly comfortable in a place with the people you're working with, that's when the real magic happens. Did you ever uh, potentially with your, you know, uh, brand new draft rookie, run like a tackle screen, you know, utilize his speed and space, ability and space? Do you want to give everything away now? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to say that, you know, my career is going to go smooth and I'm just going to do X, Y, and Z and, you know, seven Super Bowls off the bat, you know, but um, I know that I can't say that I'll give, you know, my maximum effort and seek out the best to be the best and um, handle adversity when it comes and be persistent. When Titans All Access continues, I sit down with new Titans slot receiver Tyler Boyd right here in the Bet MGM studio. The Nissan Insider is next.